This is Johnny Jr. Neal, aka Andrew Neal, and today's video we're gonna be doing a screen quiz. Basically, what we're gonna be doing is doing a quiz. I'll uh, mostly record on my dad's phone, but um, we're gonna be doing a quiz, and um, we're gonna like do a quiz, and we're gonna be doing the quiz, and basically, um, we're gonna try. Um, surviving and scream. Okay, picture this: you're home alone, and you bl and a block number begins calling you emphatically. Well, actually, it's pronounced in casually. Got it wrong sometimes. I'm not really good reading sometimes, but not. How do you respond? A, ignore it. It's obviously just a friend trying to freak you out. Two, scream into the phone and tell him to stop calling you immediately. Three, stop pranking the caller back. Adopt. Start calling the prank. Go back. Adopting a new voice every time you answer. Call the police and see, or four. Call the police and see if they can help chase the caller. Um, I would st scream to the phone and stop calling. Like tell them stop calling me immediately. Like hey, stop calling me. Like bro, I ain't playing with you. You know. Um. Next question. You decide to get out of your house and head to a neighbor party. Neighborhood party. Where can you be found? Alone, A, alone in one of the empty bedrooms. You're too in oververted to really enjoy the scene. Two, on the dance floor, flirting with your classmates. Three, looking after your friends. Somebody has to make sure things don't get out of hand. Four, trying to break in through the back door. You don't, you didn't exactly get, in, you, te you didn't technically get invited. Um. I would be on the dance floor flirting with my classmates. Like, hey, okay. Out of nowhere, the music cuts. The music cuts out, and you hear someone let out a blood curling, curling scream. What do you do? A, go investigate it. It might be someone. It might have been someone you cared about. Two, forget about someone is probably pranking. Yeah. Two, forget about it. Someone is probably prank playing a prank. Three, tell everybody not to panic and start making sure everyone's accounted for. Three, four, four, start screaming yourself so that you're the center of attention. Chantry of attention at last. Go investigate. It might be someone you care about. Okay. You discover a pool of blood and decide to split up into groups and see what else can be found. Which OG character, scream character do you buddy up with? Sydney Prescott. So we got Sydney Prescott, Gail Riley, and Dewey Riley, but it's not really her real name. Sydney Prescott, obviously. Like, who wouldn't else? Like, come on, let's be real now, guys. Let's be real. Let's just get real. Okay. Now, which new character? Now, which new scream character did you add to your team? A. Tara Carpenter, Rishi Kirsch, Chad Meeks, Wes Hicks, Liz McKenzie, Liv McKenzie, Mindy Meeks, uh, Chad. He's an athlete. Alright, safety first. Which weapon will you protect yourself with? A, a gun, a knife, or a flamethrower? A gun, like... Alright, your team discovers a dead body in the backyard. What do you, what would you, what do you do? Immediately check for a pulse and dial 000, scream, cry, and probably pass out. Look for the murder weapon, grab your car keys, and GTFO. This ain't a game of cl Cluedo. Uh, I think I'll immediately check for a pulse and, and dial 000. zero, zero. Right. Oh no, Ghostface has appeared. Where do you hide? Under a bed, that's always a solid choice. Stand your ground, better to keep the enemy in your sights. The kitchen, obvious, that's where all the nice sharpest are. Um, you're hiding, you're not running. Mm. You're hi You're not hiding, you're running. Uh, hide under a bed, I'd probably go with, yeah, yeah, you think I should go hide under a bed, yeah, I think, that's probably more like me, I'll just be hiding, be terrified. Hey, you managed to knock your enemy unconscious, what do you do next? Unlock them, you have to know who's responsible for this, tie them up and lock them in a room, put them in a boat over your, put them in the boot of your car and drive to the police, run for the love of God, just keep running. Unmask them. We want to know who it is before we die. Because, like, if we unmask them and then they kill us, we'll at least know who it was, I guess. And finally, choose a classic horror movie red flag that you would ignore. Someone on the phone says they're watching you, and your response is, This isn't funny. Inserts friend's name. Your dog aggressively barking at something unseen. 
Your friend says, I'll be right back before disappearing for a while. A sudden movement catches your eye, but you dismiss it as you imagine. And the first one, someone on the phone says they're watching. I'm the final one standing. It says, congratulations, you've been, you beaten Ghostface and made it to the end. A little worse for where the nightmare is over, but who can say for how long Scream drops in cinema, cinemas in January 13, 2020. I survived. I'm the final one standing. We did the whole quiz and we're good. Anyways, so with that, goodbye. Like, subscribe, comment down below, and hit that notification bell. Goodbye.